how to make an interactive website in Canva. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can create a website, not only a simple website, but an interactive website. So we're going to head over canva.com, sign in for an account, and we're going to see this specific page or the dashboard. Now, what are we going to do is to click on the search bar at the top and type in website, just like that. And from here, we're going to see all the templates. Basically, we're going to choose either a ready up or a preset template, or you can go ahead and start from blank. I'm going basically to select one of the templates and then we can go ahead and make it interactive. So we're going to start by heading over here and seeing a website. Let's see here a free one. I am going to select a free one because as you can see, most of these websites are going to be paid or Canva Pro. So let's head over here. I'm going to see show more. I need a, um, let's say here a good website. So I'm going to choose one, then I will be back. So here we have our website where we're going to do basically is to head over uh, the design and we can go ahead and set up the pages Now what I am going to do is to make sure that at least we have one page extended website I'm going to publish that website. Let's see if we can publish it. I think that we can publish it This is a good thing So I have here shortcutted all the procedure of creating a website. Everything is okay I'm going to let you see here that everything is uh, going cool now, what I am going to do basically is to head over here and we are going to edit the design. So I'm going to add a navigation bar. So we are going to make it interactive. So I'm going to have here a little bit of a shape. I'm going to add it. Boom, like that. So I have chosen the uh, curved, as you can see here, bo uh, the borders, curved borders. Now I'm going to change the color to something not like that. This is ugly and maybe like that. This is better. So I'm going to place it to the middle. Now we can go ahead and have some text like the headings. I'm going to type in home, for example, I'm going to make it a little bit small. So we are going to place it here. Now I'm going to make it a little bit like that. Boom. We're going to duplicate that and put it just like this. I'm going to duplicate it. Uh, I th not this, but the home. I'm going to duplicate it just like that. So I'm going to satisfy myself by having this specific, uh, as you can see, for navigation um, bar. I'm going to put this in the middle. And we are going to modify the second for the, let's say here, uh, advantage. Maybe we're going to have advantage or advantages. So we are going to have here advantages. I'm going to uh, have it widen up like that. So like this. Now we're going to have here the features. So I can go ahead and have this copied and pasted right there and I am going to make this a little bit wider so we are going to distance a little bit or put some distance in here the last one is going to be here we have the about and we have the contact so we are going to have the about uh, so just like that I, I think that I'm going to add another element which is going to be the contact and I'm going to let it like that. So I think that this is better. Here we have some distance. As you can see, I'm going to uh, put up this distance like that. And here you have it. Now, what I am going to do basically is to make sure that everything is going to be centered. I'm going to choose here the center like that. Boom. Now I'm going to start linking up uh, the, uh, as you can see here, the pages. I have here some 
uh, things in here so we are going to have the first page there's going to be more click on it click on more options link and we're going to select the uh, first page but as you can see this first page is going to be named to something so what I am going to do I'm going to click on the page and we can go ahead and have some uh, page notes so I'm going to have here the note so uh, we are going basically to have page one we are going to have here home this is the page one as you can see now the page two is going to be something else so i think that this is going to be the first second and third page so i think that we have a made or they have a made something that is uh going to be a little bit let's say here um i'm going to have it as a section so i'm going not to have this as a section but i'm going to have this image copied and pasted just like that so I'm going to let you see here the difference. Why? Because it is not going to be well explained like that. So this also is not going to work properly. I need to have everything selected, paste it as a third page. So I'm going to have this page also copied and pasted. This color should be here. So. Uh, now I'm going to add uh, the fourth or third page, I think. Yes, it is going to be the third page for the reviews. Is it for reviews? It is for the features. I have a copy and pasted features. So this page, I'm going to delete it. I'm going to have the about. So we are going to select this and that. Everything in here. Copy it. Put this in here. So we are going to also have the color is going to be copy and pasted just like that now we're going to add the last element which is going to be the contact like this we're going to have copy and pasted that so we are going to select that the phone so i want to select this only that it doesn't matter a lot in here so we're going basically to have everything set up uh, all together and here we go now I'm going to delete the other sections so this is not something that we need anymore I only need the first page this is the home page the second page is going to be uh, as you can see here the advantages we're going to name it advantages like that third page which is going to be features features like that and the fourth one is going to be the about fifth one is going to be the contact so i'm going to let you see here the things so the home page i'm going to link it as a the home one so as you can see, the sections are gone, but we have instead some pages. I'm going to link the second advantage to this one. Third one, features also like that. We're going to have the features. The about, link it, have the about page. The contact also is going to be the same one. Boom. Now I'm going to publish the website again. And you're going to find it that it is going to be only a one page website so you're going to see that it is going to be uh, here as you can see it is uh, a first page now if I am going to click to another page it is going to take us to the specific pages so here we have the pages and we can go ahead and delete as you can see this navigation bar and it is going to auto add the navigation bar to it so as you can see like that I can go ahead and have them already like that and this is how we can create an interactive website that was pretty much it for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and i hope to see you soon on the next one